Wait, do I literally just have to talk to her? Have you made up your mind? Uh, am I gonna get thrust into something immediately? I don't care, I want my steelies back. Are you sure the road ahead is fraught with danger? I'm sure. I may not remember much about who I was, but I know who I am now. I'm not a man who could turn his back on you. Oh, that's for you're wrong. I could totally turn my back on this. Or Scarlet, or even Rodea. Or in anything, I'm a ranger of seed. I made a vow to protect the people, and my word is my bond. That's your answer? Thank yes. You. Then allow me to offer you my huh? thanks. Actual appreciation from the field, Captain? That's how I feel. Is it dusty in here, or... Go see Terry and be quick about it. You got a lot to thank yes. him for. Understood. I'll go right away. Terry? It's been awful, but I must leave your company. Once you finish this part of the quest, you should have your seed seal back. Yes! I can go back to stealing the good old days. All right, Mr. Terry. Your time has come. Although I'm not bringing hoes with me this time. This time I'm just gonna quit your establishment because I don't like you. I mean, I have a different job to do. We need to talk. Oh. I see. So that's what the anonymous request was about. I'm really sorry. I'm sorry I couldn't tell you sooner. Don't worry about it. In your position, I imagine there's a lot you can't Thank share you with me. Much. Thank you for understanding. I really appreciate it. That's my line. Couldn't have done it without you. If you ever needed two big gumshoes help, you know where to find me. Yes, I do. That's why I'm staying away. Sounds good. Next time I need a private eye, I know who to call. Cecil. Hello, Aries. Have you found a place to live? Yep, Simone got me all settled in. And she even found me a job. Where at? Yes. Lubella was sold with flowers I carry in my shop. Now then, let's get you set up. Yes, yes ma'am. Thank you for helping her, Simone. I should be saying that to you. Ever since you showed up, our little town has grown and grown. As mayor, I couldn't possibly be happier. So keep bringing in more friendly faces. We'd welcome a hundred, no, a thousand new neighbors. I wouldn't. I'll do my best. All right, it's time. How do we overthrow the world? It looks like you spoke with Terry. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma As of today, I'm a ranger once again. Am I? I feel more confident just knowing you're fighting alongside us. <laughs> so do I. Now then. What the? An earthquake! Uh-oh, brace yourselves. I think it's finally over. That earthquake was huge. Thank goodness the silo didn't collapse. Rigbarth Outpost is old, but she's tough. I wonder if everybody in town is okay. Let's split up and go check on them. Got it. Oh god, Larry, Terry, you got that stanky leg going on. What on earth happened here? The pond is frozen. I wonder if I was a little chilly. Better close up the shop for today. She certainly looks happy. Oh, right. Was there any structural damage? The plates fell off the shelves. But I caught them all. Wow, you're amazing, Fuka. If she just let them all fall, then we would have to shut down for a lot longer. How depressing. There are still some places that- Oh no, not this again. I thought we were past this, Ares. You don't need to tell me every single time something happens. Is everyone okay? We're fine. No injuries to report. Speak for yourself. Do you see the size of this lump on my head? I bet you were sleeping in and got knocked out of bed. I'm just glad everyone's safe and sound. From what I could tell, the building didn't suffer any structural damage. A little shake, rattle, and roll is no match for my superior construction. And yet, had the quake felled my home, I would have gratefully rebuilt it in an even grander style. Bring on the tremors, I say. That is troubling on so many levels. Still, not every building was so lucky. We're heading out. Gotta check the damages around town and make repairs as needed. You have my gratitude. There are still some- God! Dude! You're killing me! Aries! Thank goodness, are you alright? Yeah. I'm fine, Priscilla. Looks like everyone here is safe, too. Um, Not everyone. Huh? huh? Um, Granny Yuki fell and landed hard on her back. Simone is treating her right now. Grandma, no! Is it bad? She could walk, so I don't think it's life-threatening or anything. That's good, all things considered. Who will make my bread now? But to be honest, I was scared out of my wits. This is the first time I've ever felt an earthquake like that. What, did you forget? Well, there was that one time when... Uh, never mind. 
you're here to make sure everyone's okay, right? Go check on Granny Yuki and see for yourself. But, but I want to know what you were talking about. Will do. Fortunately, Terry was crushed by a tree in a freak accident caused by an earthquake. Yeah, totally. Wasn't me setting up that tree for disaster. Just moments before. Anyway, you're just a little bruised. It'll hurt for a few days, but there shouldn't be any complications. My bottom's too well cushioned for a little tumble like that to do me in. You could do with some cushioning yourself, Simone. You're too skinny for your own good. I worry about you. It's true that I need a balanced nutritional intake to properly test the latest medicines. That's not what I mean, and you know it. It looks like everything is fine here. How do things look, Aries? Yes. Granny Yuki sustained a minor injury, but besides that, everyone's fine. Structural damage was minor, nothing that can't be fixed anyway. I found much the same on my rounds, and yet, the frozen pond, right? Yes, we need to report it back to the field captain right away. On top of a historic earthquake, the pond froze over. This is a day of first, none of them Excuse good. Me. Do you think it's related to the warden and Nordea? That's a fair assumption. I believe the root is cause is a massive and sudden loss of energy from a rune spot. Does that mean we're only now just starting to see the after effects of rune depletion? <laughs> Unfortunately, yes. The main takeaway is that we got more pressing issues than Gideon to deal with right now. Scarlet, go gather information about the rune spots around this region. Focus on any that show signs of large scale disruption. Yes, yes ma'am. Ares, I'm sending you to the Rig Barth ruins. Ruins? Shouldn't I check for interior damage? No, I need you to fetch something for what me. What is it? What's that? My you, excuse me? You, you, what? What do you need that for? Wait, hold on, you got bones just lying around? I'm an ancient dragon after all. But what does that mean? I guess that's true? It is, isn't it? Well, let's put my little jokes aside for now. You witnessed Rodea's seal being broken, did you not? Think back, what form What form did the dragon god show of shadows take while sealed? A fossil? That's right. I was the same. I've been dormant for a very long time so that my body had withered the way to bone. Unlike Rodea, my bones had grown brittle. When my seal broke, some of them snapped apart. But my broken horn has power even now. Power that we can use to quell this disturbance. I'd like for you to find it for me, Ares. I unlocked a door that blocks off a hidden passage. Enter it and venture deeper into the ruins. Hurry, I'm counting on you. I'm down. New adventure. Away! Can't you just let me skip this boss? I mean, I have no prop. <laughs> it was just watery. Hey, you know what? You know what? We'll beat him this way. Oh god, these things are taking three hits now. Don't tell me I'll actually have to upgrade my equipment soon. You'll have info for me once I beat the stage. I am excited and scared. One of these things is not like the other. Boss time? Alright, what horrible monstrosity are we about to see? Man, this place feels awfully familiar, huh? What's that over there? It's a horn, but is it the one the field captain was talking about? Uh, what? What is this? My memories. Have I been here before? You could have warned me, Captain Lydia. QB, no! Oh, not again. Why are there children here? They've seen too much. I can't let them leave. Forgive me. No! What? This powder? It can't be. The seal is breaking? This is your doing! I won't let you free Lumen Vidya. There's no doubt about it. That memory was mine. I've been here before. And I was trying to protect someone with my very life. I broke Lumen Via's seal. The same thing happened when I was protecting Scarlet. But that girl, she wasn't Scarlet. She was... Ow, my head. The dragon. But my body won't move. Oof. Oof! I'm at the silo. Oh, hey, farm dragon, you brought me back. Of course, the voice I heard was yours. Thank you. That's right, I have to deliver the horn. Thank goodness I didn't drop it. I'll take this to the field, Captain. There's no time to waste. Yeah. <laughs> Just shove that through that. 
As I hoped, it was still a full power. You did well, Ares. So why so glum? I broke your seal, didn't I? What was that? You remembered? Yeah. Just fragments. So your earthbait powers awoke when you tried to save a girl. Yes. Yeah. You know, once I realized you were an earthmate, I had a hunch that you were the one who freed me. But I had no idea what the circumstances could have led to that. By the time I regained consciousness, there was nobody in sight. It's almost funny, even as a child, you gave everything you had to protect other people. I can't say I'm surprised. You're not angry? Angry? About what? When I broke the seal on Rodea, Oswald said something about having already taken care of one dirty deed. He was talking about unleashing an ancient dragon, wasn't he? That means only an Earthmate like me could have done it. An Earthmate with no di idea what he's capable of. If I hadn't broken those seals, the world wouldn't be in such danger right now. What I did cannot be undone. <sighs> you really are too serious, or should I say boneheaded. Think about it. Even if you knew then what you know now, and realized your actions would put the world in danger, when push came to shove, do you really think you'd turn your back on the people whom, needed you, whom you needed to protect? Um, well, I... You're right. Of course I'm right. So don't regret your past actions. You can't change what happened yesterday. Tomorrow is another story. Yes, I can. Save scumming is a thing, you know. It's up to you to build a future free of regrets. Thanks, old Captain. And consider this. The fates of the dragons and earthmates are eternally entwined. One way or another, the three of us were bound to be brought together. So let's look on the bright side, shall we? Because you and I met the way we did, we have a chance to set things right. We're not too late. As a matter of fact, we're just in time. You really think so? I do, of course. We only know for sure after we've saved the world. And we will save it. Just tell me what I can do. Whoa, slow down there. Sit tight until Scarlet returns. I've returned. <laughs> I have returned. Right on cue. Hmm? What? Yeah. Don't worry about it. Just uh, give us your yes. report. Yes, ma'am. The largest rune spot disruptions were in the Whispering Woods, the Kelf Lava Caves, and the Malene Crystal Caverns. Each is exhibiting dramatic fluctuations, both geological and environmental. Mm -hmm. When we consider the safety of Rigbarth, the Malene Crystal Caverns presents the most immediate right. threat. Here goes. <laughs> it's a, it's, what the did she, I guess she did have to poo. That's a rune crystal? It's so much more brilliant than the last one. Ugh. That was before I had my horn back. With my limited power, a single crystal was all I could manage. So that's why we only had one rune crystal. Ah, now you get it. Ares, take the crystal and go to the Malene Crystal Caverns. If you place that crystal on the rune spot's energy source, you should quell the disruption for a time. Yes. Understood. Okay, but hear me out. What if I don't do that? Oh wait, the boss has been defeated. I can't even grind it. Okay, fine, I'll go do it. Hey, did you like the video? If you like what I do and want to see more of me, like and subscribe. Did you know that I'm uploading my playthrough of Rune Factory 5 on this channel, which is also streamed on Twitch? Click one of the videos on the screen if you want to see me get up to some shenanigans, and probably also embarrass myself publicly. I also have another channel where I reviewed Rune Factory 4 and made some short guides for it. If you want to see that, click the description below. So I guess I'll see you then.